Here's how to add a family member or friend's login or account to your MacBook Pro, MacBook Air, or iMac. Let's jump into the video. First, go to System Settings from the top left corner of the Apple logo, or use Spotlight Search to open System Settings. Now, select the Users and Groups option on the left side of the window. By default, you can see the main admin account and the guest user. This one I created already. To allow guest login, click on the I button next to the guest user. Enable the toggle Allow Guests to Log into this computer, activate guest login. These are the permissions to allow or disallow guest users. Click OK to save the changes and turn on guest login. Without a password, anyone can use your Mac. To create a password protected account, macOS allows you to create a new user from here. Select the Add User option on the right side. Enter your Mac login password and verify this. First, select the type of account you want to create from the three types of user accounts, Administrator, Standard, and Sharing Only. Depending on the type of account, the user has permission to install apps, make system changes, manage users, access files, and show on the screen. Here I am selecting the standard account. Give the user's details like full name, username, and auto-generated. We can also edit. Enter your new user account password, and re-enter the same password in the verify field. Lastly, there is a password hint to help you easily recall it if you forget on the login screen. Once you fill in all the details correctly, note it somewhere in case you forget in the future. Now, your account has been created successfully. To quickly switch between all user accounts, enable fast user switching from the control center settings. Select from show in menu bar with three different options, full name, account name, or icon. As you can see, the username appears at the top and switch easily from here. To show in the control center, enable the toggle and access option to switch users from the control center. Under the control center, we can switch between user accounts on Mac. That's it. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for new video update.